Hey everybody, this is Kathy again from Whole Home and Body Health and today I want to talk to you about wireless earbuds. Uh, so as you know, wireless earbuds are all the trend and one question that I get all the time is how much radio frequency am I getting from the wireless earbuds or rather are these things safe? So I want you to go ahead and take a look at this video here. Okay, so as you could see in that video, those wireless earbuds, just when I open the case, they are giving off massive amounts of radio frequency. So remember, our goal is to have our radio frequency under 10 microwatts per square meter. And in this video, I was measuring this these wireless earbuds with my Safe and Sound Pro 2. I got up to 409,000 microwatts per square meter without even taking the earbuds out of the case. So obviously that is very high from 10 microwatts per square meter up to 409,000. Uh, now part of the problem here is that these wireless earbuds communicate to each other. So obviously what that means is when you put them in your ears, it's not just that they're communicating to your device, your phone or whatever you're using it with, but they're talking to each other, that means through your brain, right? Um, I would never use a pair of these, I never have, I never would. Uh, it's just not worth the risk, no matter how you feel about this topic, this is absolutely not worth the risk. Um, it's one thing to use a phone next to your head, but imagine if you had two phones that were connected to each other, that's, I, I mean, like, it, I'm beyond words with that, with the harm that that might do to someone. So, obviously, I do not recommend them at all. Um, what's wrong with just a wired ear set? Uh, you know, that, I mean, seriously, what's the big deal about that? That's what we've been doing for a couple decades now. Go back to wired. Even better, get an air tube headset. Uh, I'll leave a link below to the one that I like. I use the Shield Your Body air tube headsets. They're by far the best quality, in my opinion. Um, and the benefit of that is that when you plug the, the, um, the end of the cord into your device, it's a wire to um, about, I don't know, a couple feet, and then the rest of it is an air tube so that you're not getting the conductivity from the wire to your head, which is awesome. And some people complain that their phone or their iPad or whatever uh, doesn't have a phone jack to it, uh, which is true these days. Um, it doesn't, but it's no big deal. You just get a little adapter, right? So this little adapter here um, will fit into your phone and then you plug your earbuds into the adapter and then that's how it works. So no big deal. Um, you can still use your wired headset. Okay, everybody, so that is it for today. Thanks for watching. As always, leave any questions, comments, concerns below. I'm always happy to answer your questions. Hit that bell so you know when I put out a new video and subscribe so I can continue to bring this information to more people. And we'll see you next time. Bye.